Do you feel like you have a contact lens stuck up under your eyelid? In this video, I want to take a second to show you an exercise that, if done right, can dislodge a contact lens so that you can find it and safely remove it from your eye. That tip and others, coming up. Hey guys, I'm Dr. Smith, and if you didn't watch my last video that discussed the fear that a lot of people have about getting a contact lens stuck behind the eyes, and if that can even happen or not, then you'll want to go back and watch that one after you're done with this one. So here's how that exercise goes. So if the contact lens is under the upper eyelid, start by looking down, then place your finger on the upper half of the upper eyelid and apply some gentle pressure. <laughs> While gently pressing on the eyelid, now glance upward. Next, lift your finger that was applying the slight pressure to the eyelid and repeat the process a few more times until the contact lens drops back down into place. This exercise is one that actually pushes the contact lens downward so it becomes recentered on the eye so that you can either see again to remove it from the surface of your eye or leave it on if it gets decentered. Let me demonstrate this for you. I'll use an Oasis transitional contact lens that can actually darken in the sun so that you can see the contact lens well for the video. I'll hit it with a little ultraviolet light to cause it to darken up and then purposely move it up under my upper eyelid. Now that it's stuck up under my upper eyelid, I'm gonna start the exercise by first glancing downward, then applying some gentle pressure on the upper part of my upper eyelid. And with the pressure still there, I'll look up and then remove the pressure from my upper eyelid. I'll repeat this until I can see the contact lens again, and then with my fingers bone dry, and I might need to dry them off a bit after playing with my eyelids, I can easily remove the lens from my eye. If this doesn't work after the first few times, then try rinsing the surface of your eye with some preservative-free saline to perhaps moisten the contact lens and loosen it up a bit first. The more dry the contact lens is, the greater chance you'll have of the contact lens getting temporarily stuck to the surface of the eye. After rinsing with a few drops of saline, go ahead and repeat the exercise again. I'll leave a link in the description below for any products that I discuss. Discuss. When you see the contact lens, be sure that when you take it off your eye that you never brush the surface of your eye with any part of your fingernails. So if you cause an abrasion on the surface of your eye, it could lead to a serious infection like a corneal ulcer, which is like getting a canker sore on the surface of your eye. And as you probably guessed it, those can cause some serious redness, serious pain, and extreme light sensitivity. It can actually lead to permanent scarring and even blindness. If you try to dislodge the contact lens and it still won't come out from under the upper eyelid, then now is the time to schedule an appointment with your eye care provider who should be able to quickly remove the contact lens if it's still there. If you feel like you need a refresher on how to put on soft contact lenses, and if you haven't watched my video on how to do that, then follow the link on the screen or in the description below for my beginner's guide on how to put on contact lenses. And I'll see you in the next video.